Hello guys, welcome to DTW Tutorials, that's Destined to Win Tutorials. Uh, today I'm going to be taking some past questions on why I can echo on the topic simple linear equation. And um, I would first of all like for you to review this particular video because this video is quite digital on the whiteboard. So try, to, can you just comment on the video if um, you connect with me? Better than my previous video, which I just used my uh, my hand, as you see, my natural hand, and on a white uh, paper sheet. So uh, please try to comment if which of the videos you prefer. Do you still connect with me teaching you on a whiteboard, uh, or you prefer the one with my with my natural hand teaching, which like a video recording? Okay, please try to comment on that. I want to know my. Uh, your view about it if you still connect with me this you know technology is advancing so i have to also advance with the trend um with the way technology is going but i would like to know if you prefer this or the old version okay so today we're going to be taking some work and neko pass questions on this subject simple linear equation okay simple linear equations are just equation of a degree of one that's x raised power one not you know when it's x raised power two you're beginning to talk about quadratic or equation okay so you will have a question here from why 2014 is a theory question and it says what if this is equal to this find p okay how do we do this all we need to do is first of all let's look let's solve what is in the denominator okay let's uh, try to look for the LCM of uh, of what's below here, that's this will be over one, okay, and this will also be over one. So here, let's find the LCM. What's the LCM, LCM of one and two? It will give us what two. So one in two is two, and two times two p will give us what four p minus two in two is one times one will give us what a one. And here, what do we have here, we have this will be what the LCM of 4 and 1 will be what 4. Okay, so what do we have? 4 and 4 is 1, and 1 times 1p we have what a p plus 1 in 4 is 4, and 4 times 1 will give us what a 4. So what are we left with? We're left with what 3 divided by this that will be 3 divided by 4p minus 1 over 2 equal to 1 over 3 divided by p plus 4 over 4 okay so here you know this is the division sign so we have to change it to multiplication and change it to multiplication this will be inverted okay so we ha we have 3 times times 4p minus 1 over 2 also don't forget if you've not subscribed to this channel please kindly subscribe okay to encourage me to do more all right for you okay we just finished um, questions on ui post um unilag and oau and um this is we're back to uh yx syllabus and uh jam syllabus to prepare students so please try to encourage me you know your subscription will would tell me that you 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 love this and uh, we want more and you guys will want more of this okay so here we have one over three times what oh this is supposed to be we are supposed to have here uh this two will come up over what four p minus one where this will be what two okay so this will be what four over p plus four all right so what do we have here okay so we have here six over four p minus one equal to what four over no three will multiply p and four so we have what three p then three times four will be what plus twelve so what do we do here we will cross multiply you know this is a theory uh theory uh, question so you have to write what your solutions okay so when we cross multiply, 6 will multiply this and 4 will multiply this. So we have what 6 bracket 3p plus 12 bracket. So equal to 4 bracket 4p minus 1. Okay, so when we open the bracket here, what are we going to have? 6 times 3p, we have what? 18p plus 6 times 12, what do we have? We have 72 equal to 4 times 4p, we have what? 16p minus 4 times 1, we have what? A4. So let's collect like terms. 16p will come here and 72 will come to this side. So what do we have? Let's draw this line here. So we have 
18 p 16 bringing it to that side to the other side we are going to have what minus 16 p equal to we are left with minus 4 here and we take a plus 72 to this side we have what minus 72 so what's 18 p minus 16 p we have what 2 p equal to minus 4 minus 72 we give us what minus 76 so we what divide both sides by 2. So we have 2p over 2 equal to what? Minus 76 over 2. So this will cancel out and 2 in 76 will be what? 2 in 7 will, will go 3 times remainder 1 and 2 in 16 will go what? How many times? 8 times. So we have what? P is equal to minus 38. Okay? So this is our first question. Let's go to our next question. Alright? Our next question says let's clear the screen our next question says from neko 2002 it says question five question five it says solve the equation this so how do we do this okay let's write this out so we have what one over three x plus what two over five equal to three x over four minus one over six all we need to do is what is the lcm okay of these two all right so the lcm of three and five is what 15 okay and uh, how 3 in 15 will be what 5 and 5 times that there's an x here we have what 5x plus 5 in 15 is 3 and 3 times 2 will give us what 6 and here we are left what's the sum of 4 and 6 will give it to be all 24 that's 6 times 4 so 4 in 24 is 6 and 6 times 3x we have what 18x minus 6 in 24 is 4 and 4 times 1 is what Four. So what do we have? We have what this. So what we do is we will cross multiply. Okay. So 15 times this and 24 times this. So we have what? 24 bracket 5x plus 6 equal to what? 15 bracket what? 18x minus 4. All right. So here. Let's open the bracket. What do we have here? 24 times 5x. We are going to have what? 120x plus 24 times 6, we are going to have what? 144 equal to 15 times 18x, we are going to have what? 27x, okay? And 15 times minus 4, we are going to have what? Minus 60, okay? So let's take like terms. So this x, coefficient of x will come here and 144 will go to this other side. So we have what? 120x minus 270x equal to minus 60 minus 144 you know when plus comes to this side it becomes what minus so when we do this 120 minus 270x is going to give us a minus 150x equal to minus 60 minus 144 will give us a minus 204 okay what do we do here we divide both sides by 150 that's minus 150 so over minus 150 divided by minus 150 okay this will cancel out the negative will also cancel out negative here the negative will also cancel out the negative here i think uh two can go here how many times like 75 times two will also go here like as one zero two one or two and i think uh three can go here 25 times and three can also go here in nine will go We'll go how many times three times remainder one that's 12 and in 12 it's go what four times so we're left with what x is equal to 34 over 25 so on our right option here is option e all right thank you for staying tuned to destined to win tutorials please like share and subscribe to this video to, the, to our channel that's our video channel that's dtw tutorials all right and also please try to comment if you like this video prefer this video than our old one or you prefer the old older version of uh, my making of videos than this new version all right thank you for staying tuned bye for now